On the corners of this glamorous hotel is a hidden speakeasy bar behind this bookshelf. A bit out of place, but actually, it makes sense. With the iconic landmark. It's not yet. You want to see it? Now? I got you getting a tour from a <laughs> Mukbang! Try chicharron glazed in chocolate ganache. And to the rooftops, I probably have one of the best sunset view in Manila. I absolutely love those posters. It feels timeless and vintage. Buddy, that kind of looks like she can have one of her posters like that. So. After the ano, Estero Gaming, Engbitin Gaming, Binondo Gaming, Afternoon Tea, we're now going to Admiral Hotel for the opening of Ruby Wong's Bar. Let's go. Admiral Hotel is located along Rojas Boulevard and it is newly renovated that gives glory and a sneak peek into the 1940s the cosmopolitan era of Manila. And just along the corners of this glamorous hotel is the hidden speakeasy bar behind this bookshelf. I'm so mind blown by this. I felt like I went into a warp hole and got transported back into 1940s or a Hong Kong action spy movie set. I just wanna be the, bread the entire vibe of this hotel is so lit. Starting from the glamorous hotel, you may think this hidden bar is a bit out of place, but actually, it makes sense. With the iconic landmark and the rich history of Manila's Golden Age, this feels like a posh bar along a sculpted street that people would go in during the 90s. The whole hotel is actually an art deco design. So we are inspired by the Spanish Filipino culture. Post it because we need that as well for so that people because we can open lang namin. Okay, girl, I got you. Yeah, you can. Yeah, I'll, I'll roll I'll around. around. Ruby Wong's Go Down Bar has seven different boots. All have red red peekaboo curtains, giving it a bit of a mysterious noir film vibe. The vibe is very cosmopolitan and cozy. Perfect for intimate gatherings and a wind down evening after a long day at work. The outside of it has a totally different vibe, kind of a beyond the food crawl in a sense. They'll be placing up noodle stations there in the future. And this is their famous bartender. And our chef, Chef Louis. Chef Louis, yeah. You invite that. Chef Louis. 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 I'm doing a vlog. <laughs> <laughs> hi. Wow, hi, welcome to Ruby Wong. Ruby Wong. <laughs> so <which one> I... <laughs> hi, Too. I absolutely love those posters. It feels timeless and vintage, and I also met somebody that kind of looks like she can have one of her posters like that. So. Tour from a <laughs> You know, I'm in sales, so I need to be like this. Kayo tayo in life. <laughs> yes, that's true, that's true. Our um, check in counter is a sit down uh, okay. area. So guests can be more.
more comfortable, you know. So this is the, we call it uh, Las Parinas de la Historia. And the uh, art, let's see. Yeah. It's actually made by a uh, French artist. Yeah, that's why right. I see the tea is showcasing the Philippines. I heard you guys have like a good tea afternoon tea, right? Oh, yeah. The afternoon tea. Normally, the afternoon tea is being, you know, served here in Canada. They yeah, have the best uh, bottles that you can do. Here in El Andrio, we have different kinds of macarons. We have bonbons. And then we have the, my favorite, petit gâteau. Oh, this is cute. This is, this is new. That's so cute. This is my favorite, actually. Carlo Mousse? Yeah, this is my favorite one. But this one, oh, it's new in my eyes. That's so cute. Yeah. So we have this one. So let you know, Mr. Kevin Ong is our partner in Chocolatier. All these are all his works. But definitely... He's Filipino. Chinese. Yeah, so mix. Mm. So, El Atrio is uh, to serve his works plus our own apartment. Mm. So, yeah. This is the, the hotel sushi. Oh. And then, this is the, my favorite bar as well. We have the Admiral Spa, the El Gallery. It's a no no. Parang meron talagang halong French details yes, sa everything, yes, no? Yes, yes. Kaya wala na sa noon. It's also good parang pag kunwari may mga nagpa-prom, yeah, ganyan, yeah, events. No. It's a vibe. Yeah. It's a vibe. We also have the video mapping in the center. It's so cool! Oh my god! We went to the rooftop section of the hotel where the Admiral Club is located for their buffet selection. There's also a video mapping in the center, kind of like the Le Petit Chef vibe, but this is not yet interactive, but it can't be. Admiral Hotel would probably have one of the best sunset view in Manila. It's a vibe! The DJ also from Ruby Wong said that they match the music to the sunset and people would just clap in awe of the experience. From the rooftop, we went down again to Ruby Wong. We checked the menu and it seems that it consists of entrees and eau de vie. A fusion and twist on familiar food that we know, such as Lumpiang Shanghai, but they have it with duck liver and duck confit, a salmon sashimi with beets, and they also have an array of curated drinks, but they also have wines and the regulars that you know. The name of the curated drinks are so cute. Mukbang! Kaya po, you know na Admiral Ruby Wong in your free time for your... Ano po agad yung daso This one is a bit controversial for us as it's the first time for everyone to try chicharron glaze and chocolate ganache. Nonetheless, it was an experience. Dapat ang ginawa niya dito, separate na chocolate. Ididip na lang. Diba? Diba tama? Didip mo. Didip mo instead of ano. Pero syempre, the more social. Glaze siya. And then I spent the rest of the night eating while my mom and her amigas spent it dancing. 